Jesus said, I am the door. By me, if any man enters in, he shall be saved and shall go in and out and find pasture. Sometimes we read the words of Jesus and we don't really understand them because they were originally spoken to a different group of people in a different place and at a different time. So what did Jesus mean when he said, I am the door? Some years ago, there was a traveler traveling through the Middle East and he came across a shepherd with sheep and he decided to stop and have a conversation with that shepherd. Uh, the shepherd introduced him to a lot of truth about his shepherding. And one, one thing that he did was uh, show him a sheepfold. Uh, the sheepfold had four stone walls and one of the walls had a gap in it for the sheep to pass into the sheepfold. The traveler asked the shepherd, he said, uh, is this where the sheep stay at night? And uh, the shepherd said, yes. He said, are, are they perfectly safe here? He said, yeah, yes, they're perfectly safe. He said, but how could they be perfectly safe seeing as there is no gate, there is no door to the sheepfold? So the shepherd said, what do you mean there's no door? He said, I am the door. I am the door. And he went on to explain what happened. He said that when he was looking after sheep, he would come just in the evening time before it got dark and he would stand in the gap and he would call to the sheep and they would come and gather around the entrance way into the fold. And then he would count them in one by one into the fold and when they were all inside, he would, uh, he would then sit in the gap or lie across the gap in the sheepfold. And he said, when that happened, no sheep could exit and no wolf could enter. He said, because I am the door. Now, when the Lord Jesus Christ said, I am the door, he wasn't speaking about sheep. He was speaking about people. But the Bible tells us that people are like sheep. It says, all we like sheep have gone astray. We have a nature which has led us away from God and we have made sinful choices which have placed us in danger. But Jesus has come into the world to make us safe. He went to the cross at Calvary. He died for our sins and he rose again the third day, having paid the price for our salvation. And now he stands at the entrance way into safety and security and he calls us to come to him. If we're willing to come, he's willing to count us in to safety and security in the sheepfold. He has come from heaven in order to make our salvation possible, in order to make us safe and secure. And presently, he is calling to you to come to him and he can forgive your sin and fit you for heaven and make you safe and secure for eternity. The verse also says that uh, the sheep will go in and out and find pasture. Now, the idea there is just that the sheep are perfectly free and perfectly content because they have a shepherd who is able to look after them. Those of us who have come to Christ and trusted him to save us, we have been welcomed into a sphere of safety and security and our hearts are satisfied with him. And this is what Jesus is promising to any person who's willing to enter in. He said, I am the door by me. If any man enters in, he shall be saved and shall go in and out and find pasture.